Is apartment floor 20 and luck be a landlord? I want to see what the craziest build that can possibly beat the final boss is. What BS can I get away with? Well, everything's good when you have an early two or three sided die. And you know what? I'm going to go goldfish. I didn't even notice that has synergy with bubbles. <laughs> oh, and speak of the bubble. You know what? Screw you, second three sided die. I want the bubble synergy. Yeah, give me that 15 coins. Honestly, three side die is the better play, but if I see a synergy, I take a synergy. Speaking of synergy, I could go jellyfish go for a little fish build treasure map could be fun adds a key and a chest when completed 20 uh spin slayers actually kind of doable speaking of fish build let's go crabs is a whole ocean biome in here oh my more crabs well i'm not saying this is a crab build yeah i've done a crab build fairly recently it's more of an ocean build uh bears are sometimes aquatic they've been known to take a dip in the stream, you know, they go fishing. Um, uh, uh, nobody heard that. I'm gonna do something fun. Take a thief without knowing how I'm gonna get rid of him. It's a mystery, really. How will I get rid of the thief? Will it be a banana peel? Will it be a bounty hunter? Oh, it'll be a bounty hunter. Or <laughs> I could feed the goldfish. Hmm. Fish. That's what I'm doing today. That's my mood right now. I'm just pure chaos right now. Toddlers can also eat bubbles, but I don't want to get in the way of the fish food. Assuming it happens, there's only one more turn. Well, a time to double my odds. Get the bubble. You suck. Well, thanks for trying, fish. Oh, more bubbles. Yes, redemption time. That's what I'm talking about. Vara soap for all the bubbles. More bubbles. Don't mind if I do. This is um, actually the most bubbles I've ever gotten in early game. We got a fish bubble build. Holy cow, Lucky Capsule's great early. Man, clear sky, too bad that's useless to me. Shrine for when I inevitably kill that thief, I could get a spirit. Cleaning rag's probably better, but shrine is more fun, so I'm gonna take it. And I think I can remove a little from my inventory, like the flower. Hey, there we go, good old fish. A pear, sure, if something buffs the pear, it gives one more. I don't know how I'm going to buff the pear, just like I don't know how I'm gonna get rid of the thief. But that's a future Tyler problem. I just got 71 on this floor. Holy shit. Give me an orange. So how do I want to buff this pair? I mean, a chef would be great. An arrow sometimes hits. Hell, even a buffing capsule. But now I can be kind of choosy. How much do I actually get per spin? I'm actually doing terrible per spin. I've kind of wasted a bunch of good chances. So now I've got a lot I need to figure out. At least I'm making right now, but it's kind of starting to go downhill. Uh, three bears for Goldilocks or checkered flag. Rabbits have a 100% chance of adding five rabbit fluff. That is a hell of a shed. I mean, I know I'm more likely to pick up one rabbit than I am to pick up two bears, so I'll try shedding season. These actually aren't great. I'm going to reroll. Hey, it's the rabbit. Yeah, give me the fluff. Bear synergy. I guess I could have gone bear essence, but how could I have known? I'll still take it now. Makes my bear a threeper. So now the shedding has happened. Now I really want to be choosy with what I take, right? Because all these twopers, well, I guess my average is still way less than two, huh? But still, I'll take anything. It can be good money now. I, I should be likely to get something really good now. I can't do another goldfish. It doesn't make any sense now. I'm not even producing bubbles. <laughs> I figured out how I'm getting rid of the thief. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the rabbits have paid off. Fuck. Well, at least I got three spirits. Did I lose my pair? What did you snag? You got both crabs, the pear, a goldfish, and then something that was probably all a dud, I think. I guess for the record, the goldfish and pear weren't doing anything. Rip crabs. We just did some nuclear bomb testing over the ocean. Good thing I took the shrine, though. At least I can profit off of my incredible unethicalness. Keep skipping. I was really hoping it would hit the thief. I would have been set for like three rent payments, but I'm still doing pretty good right now. I think on average I improved. The crabs were only sometimes good. Okay, I need to do better than this. I'm not going another thief. Wine's all right. It becomes a three per eventually. Uh, purple pepper is awesome with all my rabbit fluff. And I can thin away my coin. Also, treasure map. I need to click on it to activate it. <laughs> good thing I did. I... For some reason, thought it happened automatically after 20 turns. Don't get me wrong. Uh, the way it does it is way more friendly to the user. But I kind of forgot it just worked that way. Take another orange. I got a lot of tupers, though. I'm kind of setting myself up for failure with all these tupers in the long run. But Lucky Capsule's nice. 
Hey, my rabbit's leveled up. Mrs. Fruit. Oh, well, that's really good with all these fruits I have. Yeah, it turns out I'll be all right now. Start thinning. Still want to look for more bubbles. Eh, seed grows into fruit for Mrs. Fruit. Good, she's not a wine mom. I will take a removal capsule any day of the week. Oh, and I got a peach out of the seed. This is a very fun run, what can I say? Yellow peppers is 20 free money. Ancient lizard blade gets me... I don't have many duplicate. I have rabbit fluff, I have oranges, I have duds, right? Well, it's a symbol in your inventory, so it's probably only oranges and rabbit fluffs. It doesn't appear to me that these are the same, and even if they are, it's not the biggest deal. So it gives either 32 or 24, which is better than yellow pepper. Ooh, a spirit. Sure, why not? Fruit basket is good, but Mrs. Fruit's gonna eat all the fruits? I feel like I want rusty gear for the rabbit fluff. I mean, rusty gear is sick. Yeah, so how much does this actually give me now? 16? Oh, right, because it started at 40, not 48. Silly me. Well, coconut for Mrs. Fruit and thin out my deck. Can send off the pearl. So the existence of Mrs. Fruit now means I can also take regular bananas to get rid of the thief. Will it happen? Who knows? Hey, Mrs. Fruit finally ate. I mean, there's so many targets, I'm shocked it took this long. Take like a lucky capsule over a rabbit. There's a lot more exciting rares out there. I forgot about that way to get rid of the thief. The only downside is I also lose Mrs. Fruit. I don't want to lose Mrs. Fruit. If I lose Mrs. Fruit, I don't have a build. I have all these garbage fruits that would just be sitting around, taking up space. Now you might be thinking, well, take Zara for the chaos, but hear me out. What if the thief just has a massive bounty? What if I just build up his bounty to the moon? Isn't that more exciting? I feel like it is, at least in my mind. I want to see how big I can make this thief. And then ideally get him with a Midas Bomb. Hell yeah, I got my bar of soap back. If I can get some goldfish synergy, that'd be great. Take a removal capsule. Ah, oh, there you go. Mrs. Fruit's consuming now. Now I would maybe take Zara off. Also, I mean, the rabbit was a tough choice. Maybe I should have taken it because it's going to come at three per in no time, but I don't know. Just didn't feel right. Which, huh? Oh, Tomb is better, I think. Even though I do have a cat and owl, both those are going to go soon. And Tomb is actually just fun. I do like lockpick or shedding season. <laughs> do I want to deliberately take shedding season? I mean... The more rabbit fluffs I have, the more likely they are to become forpers, and the more rare stuff I get. You know what? I'm gonna willingly take shedding season. Maybe I should have grabbed the other rabbit then. So I'm a man of my word. I'm getting rid of the cat and probably the owl fluff. Hey, the goldfish did its job. Now it's time to return to the big wide ocean. Be free, goldfish. Be free. Hey, look at that. Rabbit fluffs are worth four. Rabbit fluffs are worth four. Why, why don't I want to shed all over it? Well, the capsule are orange. I'll go orange. Feed the fruit lady. If only there were some way to get rid of this thief. And if only whenever the opportunity was presented to me, I would stop rejecting it. Oh, bear or seven? Bears are worth three. Yeah, but I kind of want the seven. I'm in the mood for a seven. That's just how I feel right now. You don't understand. I'm doing okay on rent. Ooh, 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 a bunch of removal tokens. Don't mind if I do, because hear me out. Is this how I get rid of the thief? Aha. No, wait, Robin Hood doesn't destroy thieves. He buffs them though. So I obviously take Robin Hood. Hell yeah, give me that. Whoa, okay, I'll go gray pepper here. I'm about to get a bounty of symbol bombs. Yeah, thief synergy. Now I'm incentivized to keep the thief around. Uh, ish, somewhat. Target for Robin Hood, or do I want more removal capsules? Call me crazy, I want more removal capsules. I mean, Target's good. Don't get me wrong. D more removal capsules. I should have used one. Sorry, I just got so excited. Void stone, let's, yeah, remove some junk. Like this owl. I could get rid of weaker things, like the jellyfish, and now I have another removal capsule. Now I'll lose the puffer fish so I can get its bonus as well. Look at all these rabbit fluffs. It's gonna overrun the board. Think a bronze arrow is quite good. Buffed by Robin Hood at least a little. My deck is size 20. Yeah, Robin Hood buffing. Void stone or orange? Let's go orange again. Two foods just waiting to be eaten. 
Made rent, slipping a little bit. It is kind of getting scary. Let's see if I can do something better. Joker, no, I gotta go for a suits build sometime soon. Moon buffs a rabbit, and I do want more rabbits. So I suppose I'll take it. It's lockpick. Yeah, I'll take a lockpick so I can take chests. And now I have so many damn removal tokens. Three side die is not good. Well, the rest of what I have is good. It's either a three per or better rabbit fluff, which is better, or the arrow or the thief. Yeah, but at some point I'll probably want to remove something. I mean, every rabbit fluff is probably going to be better. Do I want a wolf? I don't really want a wolf. Wealthy capsule or peach? You want a peach. And now should really consider removing junk. Screw it. Who needs the wine? Bears worth three. See ya. I might even launch the tomb, too. I think I'll just figure out how to destroy the tomb. Yeah, that's the plan. I think I could take another rabbit for more rabbit fluff. Maybe the bronze arrow isn't good? Yeah, it was good this time. Got me an 18er. Target's not bad. Yeah. He's a lot of money if it's by Robin Hood, which it was. Well worth it. Okay, I don't think I need another rabbit. Which is why I'm taking it anyway. Let's go. What could go wrong? I'll go Tedium Capsule. That can give me a banana. <laughs> or a banana peel. Not that. Oh my god, I got a banana. <laughs> Alright, it's, it's finally time to set up... The Thief's Demise. I got a watermelon. Yo, okay. Making rent. I just gotta have business fruit, eat the banana, and then have it go off. Red pepper essence is never happening, ever. Nine human faces. That's also never happening. I'll just grab anthropology degree anyway. These ain't it. I don't think I need another Mrs. Fruit. It's just gonna happen eventually. Oh, Mrs. Fruit's a 20 per. <laughs> I also realized this. Don't I want the thief to go off when I'm fighting the landlord? Yeah, but how can I control that? Zoroff is no longer necessary. You just take an apple for Robin Hood. And I don't want my seeds going into rare symbols. I want them going into Mrs. Fruit Food. Take a guillotine. Bronze Arrow could be bad. Not saying it is, but it could be. Sure, I'll take another rabbit fluff. What could go wrong? Oh, it's happening. It's happening. The 216er. Ooh. Highlander. Highlander's pretty good. You know what's not so good? The watermelon. Because it's a four purchase like rabbit fluff, but it doesn't synergize with the other rabbit fluffs. I think we know what must be done. Hey! We got him! Finally! The 219. Well, making that rent. The boss is gonna be pretty tough, but I will find a way. And I want the way to be through rabbit fluffs. A pirate. I guess I could disable lockpick. Yeah, screw it. Give me the pirate. Those are fun. So yeah, you could just... Boom. Not like it matters. I didn't have any out, but... I'll just do it now so I don't forget. Of course, there may come a point where I'll be like, Well, going for pirates is just a mistake now. I'd rather just focus on uh, our rabbit fluffs. Hey, my other rabbits are evolving. You'll love to see it. Okay, but what if I go Zara? <laughs> I think I've decided my new goal. I'm so close to getting a full board of rabbit fluffs that I have to achieve it. And the way I achieve it is by getting rid of the faces aggressively. Oh yeah, it's Zaroff time. I'll keep him around at least for a bit. Can't let these other pesky faces get in the way of my full board rabbit fluff, which is on pace to happen. Of course, I could still take faces. I don't want to do King Midas uh, that runs the risk of making a coin that isn't eaten the, by the pirate before it gets destroyed by Zoroff, but Joker can just be eaten. Lime Pepper, do I have many rerolls? I have three rerolls, that's 18 money. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna get a fish again. So why not more peppers? Oh, billionaires just get owned automatically. I think it would have been better if Zoroff owned him. Ooh, a mega chest. Well, you know what? Since I don't really care about the pirate in the long term, I'll actually leave Lockpick off, believe it or not. There goes Mrs. Fruit. I'm gonna save my mega chest for the landlord fight. Uh, speaking of, I am going to make it there, so I'll jump ahead to... Uh, landlord fight? Will I? No, I'm gonna play this out, because I, I have some preparing to do still. This deck needs to truly be ready for the landlord fight. 
and that involves doing a little bit more preparation than you may think. I do need removal capsules. That is important. Not using them yet. Skip it. Another human gone. Only Zoff remains. I still have the pirate, though. I want the pirate gone, ideally. Take a reroll capsule. I need the pirate gone, or just to eat the mega chest only after I get to the bo boss fights. And actually, this is fine. We're good. So now, final boss abound. Now I can re-enable lockpick so I can start doing damage. A very big symbol bomb for more removal tokens is great. And then coffee gives me two additional spins before I would pay rent. That's really good. Give me a damn silver arrow. Oh, very big symbol bomb. Hell yeah. All right, let's see what I can get here. Let's see if I get anything fun with item capsule. Void stone's a classic. Lucky capsule's a classic. I could skip here and here. Golden arrow. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, billionaire's free money. <laughs> I can go for another thief since I have Zoroff out. Yeah, but no, I need more rabbit fluffs. So that went quite well. How do I still have Robin Hood alive? So bronze arrow has to go now that I have a silver and a gold arrow. Its value just starts decreasing at this point. And then I'll hold on to my other removals. Because a lot of the board's still gonna remove itself. It's landlord fight time. And I mean, this, this deck is going wonderfully so far. I do get a rare here, but to be honest, I'm more in the mood for an item capsule. Very rare symbols give one less, re-rolling costs one more. Eggs cannot be destroyed or removed. That's right, I forgot the landlord does things. 17 rabbit fluffs. I need to re-enable lockpick. And then, I mean, I technically can't do a full board of rabbit fluff yet. I can, however, get rid of the moon and get rid of the highlander just so I can see more rabbit fluffs to give me more dopamine. Good boy, pirate. Way to eat that mega chest. Now I'm skipping a bit. See if there's anything good. No rabbit fluffs. Robin Hood takes more spins to give coins. Item capsule is no effect. No, I still have one. Well, I guess I just remove it then. I have a small symbol bomb. How long have I had that for? I will not even feed my Zoroff. Just not feeling it. I am shocked though that Zoroff has not hit these other faces yet. Like, do I have to do it myself? I have only three removal tokens, so I can't. I have to have Zoroff do it. Stop being lazy and kill these people. What do I have? Coins can't be destroyed or removed. Dwarves give a 50% less. I have one less symbol to choose from. That's fine. Okay, another fluff has just shown up. You know what I need to start doing? I need to actually maybe get rid of the arrows now. If I want a full board of rabbit fluff, I need arrows gone, but I also need rabbits gone. It just occurred to me. You know what? I'll still remove one arrow though. Silver arrow can go. Just because I now have two removal capsules, if they get doubled, then at least I can still you remove one thing. And now, guillotine is no effect. Five side dies worse. Monkey is worse. Okay, don't take billionaires. Come on, Zoroff. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Pirates are worse. Hex of Destruction's been added. That needs to go. Not even gonna let that stick around. It's gonna take forever for me to get tokens, so maybe I'll just lose a rabbit in the meantime. Because yeah, look, there's my 20th rabbit fluff. I could theoretically get a full board now, but I'm really just hoping to get any removal token possible. Slowly whittling down this landlord. I got another dud. No adjacency, three side dies worse. And the odds of me getting all rabbit fluffs are astronomically low. But I want to believe. I also want to believe that Zorov can get rid of these fools. I'm not even in the mood for a lucky capsule. That's a lot of rabbit fluffs, that's for sure. So I made this rent. And I get nothing directly helpful. I'll take the egg carton for eggs. Moving symbols costs one more. That's brutal. Gray pepper's worse. Very rares are less likely. Well, maybe I can just pick up raw rabbit fluffs. And actually, maybe I should have kept the rabbit alive so that it could still keep making more rabbit fluffs, if that makes any sense. Like, I could have 30 rabbit fluffs and then maybe a chance to get all rabbit fluffs. I don't know. I'm actually really impressed that Zoff's incompetence. This was the best rabbit fluff spin yet. Unfortunately, I'm basically out of time. Void fruit can't be destroyed or removed. That's pretty much the only real impactful one. 
One more chance for something. Here we go. Hey, Zaroff did something. Way to go. Well, at least uh, that can deliver a killing blow. Yeah, that was the rabbit fluff build. Let's run it back, see if I can get any other fun builds.